I were to simply start this video off by saying how much I fucking love this game, I wouldn't be able to get any progress done. Uh, not gonna lie, already beat the game, so I simply made a second character because I just wanted to. And uh, this game, if you have a PlayStation 4, totally fucking worth it. Buy it, $20 on 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 the uh, PlayStation Store. If you like Dark Souls, you'll like this. when he really pisses me off, but other than that, actually a really good boss. I love how when I don't record, I can't beat that boss for the life of me, but when I start recording, it's, it's suddenly possible. So, uh, yeah, Bloodborne, um, can be a difficult game if you don't know what you're doing, if you've never played Blood, like a Dark Souls type game before would be hard for you, but uh, you know what? I think it's great. I don't necessarily have many reasons as to why I'm recording a video, especially this, but like, you know what? It's, it's, it's summer, I, I need something to do, and you know what, since, since the, uh, last video I uploaded was a month ago, it's like, you know what, I can find something to upload, and then I realized I became hyper addicted to this game not even four, five days ago, so it's like, you know what, take a game I'm addicted to, 
my YouTube channel combine content. At least that's that's my mindset. Basic plot, you are you're a hunter in in a place filled with monsters and and you kill stuff. This is, is basically the basic plot. It's a lot of running around and a lot of exploring. Sometimes it can be hard to know where to go next. But that's the fun of it, because the more you explore, the more you like realize where you should probably be going. And uh, it's fucking great. be a hunter. Very sorry. The incense must have masked your scent. Good. Good. I've been waiting for one of your ilk. These hunts have everyone all locked up inside. Waiting for it to end. It always does. Always has, you know. Since forever. But it won't end nicely. Not this time. Even some folks hiding inside are going by it. Screams of women folk, the stench of blood, the snarls of beasts. None of them's too uncommon now. Yarnum's done for, tell ya. But if you spot anyone with their wits about them, tell them about this here Erden Chapel. They'll be safe here. The incense wards off the beasts. Spread the word. Tell them to come on over. If you wouldn't mind. <laughs> This is a good character. All right, now there's a couple different ways you can go. You can go up over this way. But uh I realized that from this point on, I forgot that I had muted my mic and started talking about random stuff. Basically, what I said was, once I got back, um, that there are some enemies in this game that have high health but hit really weak, and have low health but hit really hard. And I also basically said that you should never get too cocky when you're playing this game or else you'll punish for it, and I went, I went on this little spiel about how I was finding it more difficult to um, make YouTube videos due to, you know, different situations going on within the house, making, making me lose more and more motivation to actually try doing this, but uh, I'm going to take this moment to say that I uh, really want to you know, get back into this and, like, try making more content. And seeing as, like, as I said earlier, that I really love this game, I'm gonna try recording more Bloodborne videos and see how that goes. And, uh, you know, see if I can kick off my YouTube channel from there. Uh, what's about to happen now is I'm gonna try fighting these two people realize how poor of a decision that is and uh, run away like a little bitch because I don't want to die. So I'm gonna let the rest of the video play out. Uh, if you enjoy, leave a like, comment, comment down if you want to see more Bloodborne videos. And uh, I'll see you all next time.